Hey guys, I'm Renika. I'm happy to see you on my channel. A few days ago, I again visited my friend's VR club. I took from him an expensive VR headset. It cost near four thousand dollars. The headset called Varjo VR One. The Varjo company claims the headset resolution like uh, human eyes. We tried to launch the headset in the VR club on a thirty-sixty video card, but uh, it works with trouble. Twitch and picture. So his video card is weird for the headset. I have got a 5090 video card and maybe here it will work good. So, let's go to try it. At the start the headset was cost almost $6,000, very high price. The headset is from 2019 year and it's amazing, even for now. Recommended system requirements for VR1 are 2018 GPU, processor Ryzen 7 and 32GB memory. I have got 3019 GPU, Ryzen 9 and 64GB memory. I don't understand why I have the memory error like in the VR club. Maybe Half-Life Heavy with Varjo VR1 for my computer? By the way, with Oculus Quest 2 I didn't have the same error. Only two buttons, no more, so well. But the headset is for commercial, not for home applications. I use controllers and base stations from the Valve Index headset. I saw the plants in the game, it's amazing, so really. Also, I can read captions on the bottles, cans of paper. You can't read the small text like ingredients if you play it in this game with Oculus or Valve. With Varjo I can read it. Sometimes I stay and look at the building's robots. It's so beautiful and unusual that I want to consider the objects around me. Wonderful. It's hard to believe, but the headset doesn't have controllers, by stations, without sound and no headphone port. In a few texted reviews, write it about the headset has a headphone port. I tried to find it, but my attempts were unsuccessful. Why is that people wrote it without the headset? The most exciting part of the headset is the display resolution. The headset has one small display with high resolution in the center. And I display like Oculus Quest 2 Peer Eye around the first. The small display in the eye area and the display is the same like human eye. Different headsets from the Varjo company have all displays with a resolution like a human eye. Very interesting to try. I also had a teaching picture, but not so hard like in the VR club. In game video you don't see the trouble. I played near 30 minutes and I want to repeat it. I had dizzy after playing. Not comfortable, but I was glad to try the headset. I see it almost like you see the game in this video. If it wasn't for the Twitches, I might forget that I'm not in the real world. Said you can figure out how the troubles looks. If you have ideas why it happened, write me in the comments. The game clearly has more potential than uh, what we can get now. So said the people faces looks not realistic. May you have misunderstanding what the symbols on the bottles or on the posters. So it's about somewhere in Eastern Europe. In such place, Russian language. In my city, many, many similar houses. I love this game. It's like I'm playing where I used to be. <laughs> One more trouble with tracking. I don't know why, but controllers went away a few times and shifted to the left. I put my hands in the middle, but it was on the left. 
the base stations was installed right in the beginning in the VR club we had the same but it's not to be critical to try the headset because it's not about tracking The weight of the headset is 605 grams with head strap. The head strap very comfortable, high quality, so easy to fix on the head and forget about it. I don't know why the company made a mirror from the headset. I think it was not a good idea. The mirror has many scratches and close range the headset looks not good. Headset has an eye tracker. I can notice how my pupils change size with different light. It's funny. Also, you can see how dots change color when the dots it's tracked. For the more, the lenses adapt focus for the eyes. Thank you for watching my video. Put home, write comment and see you later. Bye!